Teachers and their union in the South Bay raising the volume about the safety of reopening in person learning. This comes as coronavirus continues to hit the region harder than any other county as a whole. News 8's Evan Rani live outside Chula Vista Elementary School District headquarters there. And Evan, there was a board meeting that was held on how to safely reopen. I know a lot of parents there want the kids back in class, but a lot of the teachers and the union say, hey, not so fast here. Yeah, they say they want better safety protocol measures in place in order to head back into in person learning. That board meeting was held last night. It was originally to discuss the reopening of the school, and that would mean that they would reopen on October 26th. That was their original set date. However, that date has now been postponed. It was scrapped at last night's meeting. They do not currently have a date for when those 22,000 students will head back into the classroom, whether it be in a hybrid method or any method at all. So it stays virtual for now. This all comes as the teachers union says they will pursue legal action unless the district provides an updated and enforceable safety protocol. There's much ground for you to regain if you are to win back that trust. Until then, I fear there's really no such thing as a safe return to school. And we all want the same thing. We cannot get there if we're not all involved. And the first sound there was from a teacher that was voicing their concern. The sound after that was from uh, the administration, the, the superintendent team saying uh, that they are going to be doing the best they can, that they are looking out for teachers and for parents, and that they are not going to open unless it is safe to do so. Now, the rate of coronavirus spread is higher around the South Bay compared to the rest of the county. And as last night's special board meeting got underway, those comments from concerned parents and uh, teachers were read out loud. The district has now postponed that October 26 reopening date. They have no new date proposed. District leaders did outline a safety plan that they say they'll follow to safely reopen, and that includes masks, social distancing, sanitizing, and a possible hybrid schedule between in-person and virtual learning. But for now, virtual learning as a whole continues. No plan for in-person learning to pick up at any point. It will not be until Wednesday of next week that that board meets again to discuss the potential for that new date. And of course, that new date can't even be set until safety protocol is agreed on and until the teachers union and parents uh, agree to enforcing that. So uh, it is still going to be quite a process before we see Chula Vista schools reopening, and that will likely mean a date beyond that October 26th deadline. In Chula Vista, outside of their uh, elementary school board headquarters, I'm Evan Nirani, News 8.